Yeah, you know, I, I come from a big family, so, um, you know, the holidays for me is just um, the time that I'm excited to do nothing but spend time with my family. We love to cook and, and eat and, and play games, and, and so much a part of that, too, is, is um, you know, just everybody coming together and, and um, celebrating. So, uh, you know, we, we always cook our meals together, and that is such an amazing experience because... Um, all the different experiences that you have with that from, from the, the tangible, from the, the feeling of the food and, you know, the familiar cookie dough to the smells of putting it in the oven and, and you know, creating something together and then, and then having that realized creation there and to, to you know, break bread in your home and, and everybody to, to um, you know, so much love pours into the food and then, and then so much love pours out of it when, when, you're, when you're consuming it. And so that was always just... Um, I, uh, iconic part of the holidays for me and then also you know it's always fun to think all year like oh what's the, what are they gonna like what's my mom gonna like and you know as you're younger you have to be really creative about you know what you can give your family members and you watch your your other siblings or your dad give your mom special things and vice versa well I think that you know the most important gift is something that lasts um and that's why, you know, you go through the holidays with, you know, all your nieces and nephews and you see all these amazing toys that they get and then they're just on the floor five minutes later. Um, and you notice that adults don't get those same toys because they're going to be on the floor five minutes later. Um, so, you know, things that last are, are always the most powerful things. So, you know, I think that things that last are our memories. So whether it's, it's you know, a photo album, something that was a meaningful moment, something that you make and, and you know, really a fragrance is something, you know, my father would always give to my mother. We all within our family would buy each other different fragrances because um, it tells a story and it's, it's each different time period in your life. And, and it really like, it's, it's a nice identifier. It's, it's also a little bit of a selfish gift because um, it's so comforting when you're near someone that you love and you recognize their smell. It's just like, ah, oh, that's you. <laughs> and so it's, it's a very selfish gift to give because you get so much pleasure out of the gift as well. Um, so there was a lot of fragrance swapping in my family. Um, a most memorable holiday gift, you, my sister, um, I, you know, I live in New York now, and um, for, um, for one of my gifts, she um, videotaped her kids going to school from before they woke up, walking in, just a day in the life. And because I don't get to be with them all the time, and I love them as if they were my own children, I actually tell them that I'm their mommy. <laughs> and she videotaped the entire day and, and making their breakfast and brushing their hair and, and um, you know, edited it together beautifully, dropping them off at school, their sweet faces when you pick them up. And it was just such an incredible gift because it's, it's something that I can't be there for every day, but that I just like, oh my gosh, it's just it's so emotional watching that. I would give them a vacation because <laughs> I would like to join them on that. Um, I don't know, whatever whatever special moments you can create. You know, my mom was always um, trying to have us create memories all the time, you know, and that's why I, I keep going back to that. It's just like, you know, if, if, if the world ended tomorrow, what, what would you have to hold on to? And that's why, you know, I love cooking so much because it's it's such an experience. It's, for, it's such a feast for your senses. Um, so, you know, things that come and go... Um, with the time, you know, things that you can grow out of aren't as, as powerful as, as something that lasts. Um, so what's something that you can give someone that they will adopt as their own? Um, so I don't know. When, when, you know when, you, when you try to think of things to give someone, it's the same thing that I said I liked receiving, you know, whether it's photos or a video of a family or, you know, a fragrance or something that you can cook. It's just it's something that gives you a life experience that's beyond just a, a material thing. You know, my mom was probably my biggest um, idol my whole life. And so I'm honestly so excited for her to smell this because I'm going to have to fight with her. See, the problem is my, my mom and my sisters and I, we all like the same fragrance. So here we're all going to be wearing, we're all going to be wearing Gucci Premier and you're not going to, if you're, you were blindfolded in a room, you're not going to be able to tell us apart. <laughs>